let's take a look at the 10 biggest home sales in Massachusetts in 2022. And these places are just amazing. This is gonna be fun. I feel like I'm about to do a lifestyle of the rich and famous episode. So here we go. Hi, it's Jeff Chubb. I'm a recovering investment banker turned real estate agent that has sold more than a thousand homes and I'm one of the state's top agents. Let me know if you have any real estate questions because I'm here to help. So on to the top 10. Number 10, welcome to 29 Commonwealth Avenue, unit number two in the back bay. This luxury three bedroom, three and a half bath home spans 4,186 square feet. Now the unit is in the building that was once famous for being the first high rise in Boston. Hayden Hall is a boutique building with nine units of 24 hour concierge. This duplex has soaring ceilings and oversized windows with one garage parking space. Now the unit was listed for $11,500,000 while selling for $11 million and $150,000. Number nine, the home at 51 Scotch Pine Road is nestled in Wellesley, a nearly one and a half acre lot. It is six bedrooms, eight full and two half baths. The home went through a full scale renovation and addition. It doesn't look like an expense was spared with the renovation of this home. It's stunning. I personally love all the warm wood tones and immaculate woodwork throughout the entire home. The huge kitchen with sub-zero refrigerator and freezer as well as a vaulted ceiling makes this kitchen just incredible. Then there's the indoor pool. That has to be one of the biggest indoor pools I think I've ever seen. And again, with the vaulted ceilings and stonework. Other features include a finished basement with tiered seating to reflect a movie theater setting, a fitness center, and a wine cellar. Now this home was listed at $12,500,000 and sold for $11,550,000. Number eight, 34 and 52 Callet Lane in Barnstable is a waterfront estate with views of East Bay and Nantucket South. This home is nestled on more than three acres with 200 feet of water frontage. In total, the estate consists of eight bedrooms with seven full and two half baths. The five bedroom main house was renovated in 2020 and offers more than 5,700 square feet. The home sports an open layout that connects the main level to the patio and pool. The guest house is a three bedroom, 2,500 square foot house. Being that I'm a boat guy, my favorite feature of this home is that boat dock. The listing price was $13,500,000, while the property actually sold for $12,250,000. Number seven, the single family home at 10 Channing Street in Cambridge is a seven bedroom, seven full and four half bath home that spans a total of 9,080 square feet. It's a new renovation where the developer used only high end finishes throughout. This house has an elevator to help you get around the four levels of this home. So, so cool. It's an amazing blend of new and old. Downstairs in the kitchen, you'll find a custom kitchen with marble countertops and custom millwork. The master bedroom suite that connects to a 24-foot terrace sports a huge master closet, four-piece bath with a soaking tub, steam shower, and double vanity. The house is just amazing, but I think it was the location that really made it happen as it was located within one mile of Harvard Square. The property was listed for $14 million and sold for $12,500,000. Number six, the home at 5 Lewisburg Square in Beacon Hill is a six-bedroom, five-full bath, and one-half bath home that's spans 4,852 square feet. Lewisburg Square is one of Boston's most premier addresses with this home situated on the sunny side of the square. This is a six story home with elevator access to nearly every floor. Downstairs, you're gonna find a grand double parlor with soaring ceilings. The gourmet kitchen connects to the dining room as well as the Sunfield Conservatory with floor to ceiling windows. Live in history while enjoying the ultra modern conveniences, which include two parking spaces in this home. Now the property was listed for $13 million and sold for the seller's asking price of $13 million. Number five, the fifth most expensive home in Massachusetts in 2022 was in one of the most premier buildings in Boston, which is the Mandarin Oriental. Unit E12B is a two bedroom, three full bath and one half bath condo that spans 3,970 square feet. One of the amazing things about owning in the Mandarin Oriental so you can use all the hotel features like spa and room service. This unit had unobstructed views of Boston skyline, Cambridge, as well as the Charles River. It's located on the 12th floor. It's worth a double-sized terrace facing Boylston Street while inside having a custom gourmet kitchen with an expansive living and dining room. The seller's asking price was $12.9 million with the selling price being over their asking price at $13.5 million. Number four, the property at 198 and 227 Bridge Street in Barnstable consists of four structures set over two lots totaling 3.73 acres of waterfront footage. Now this family estate located in Osterville has not one, but two deep water docks, a granite deep water ramp, two 
two deep large boat slips, and two sandy beaches. The main house consists of six bedrooms, while the guest house has two bedrooms. There's also a studio apartment and fully refurbished oyster shanty with lofts. So cool. Talk about a super unique and amazing property. The house's original asking price in 2019 was $25 million. The sellers reduced the price multiple times down to $15.9 million when it sold for $13 million and $750,000. Number three. We have another Barnstable home at 186 Windswept Way. Now, the property consists of four waterfront acres overlooking Katuit Bay. The home spans over 10,000 square feet and has eight bedrooms and six full and two half baths. Quick highlight reel of this home would be the in-ground pool, the boathouse with incredible views, 437 feet of waterfront footage, big deep water dock, and sandy beach. Inside the home, you're gonna find a spacious living area with soaring ceilings, arched windows and doors, as well as six fireplaces. It's a stunning house where the new owners, they're most likely going to do some renovations. Now, the property was originally listed at $18.8 million in 2021 and had two price reductions to get down to the asking price price of $15,495,000. The buyer and seller would later agree to a final sales price of $14 million. Number two, and we're back into Boston and back at Lewisburg Square in Beacon Hill. Now, 17 Lewisburg Square is a five bedroom, three full and three half bath that spans 7,482 square feet. This beautiful brick brownstone is also located on the sunny side of the square that spans six levels with elevator access. Now, the gourmet kitchen with top of the line appliances connects to the dining room which overlooks the private courtyard. The home also sports five spacious bedrooms, exercise studio, laundry on three levels, as well as an amazing private roof deck with panoramic views of the city skyline. This is one of the most distinguished addresses in Boston that also sports two private parking spaces. This home was listed for $15.5 million and sold for $14.8 million. And aren't you the most expensive house in Massachusetts in 2022? This home was at 159 Main Street in Barnstable. Breathtaking is probably the best way to sum up this place. It's an eight bedroom, eight and a half bath home that is over 10,000 square feet. It is nestled on more than four acres with 400 feet of water frontage. It's got an affinity edge pool with cabana, a private deck with boathouse and waterside dock. Man, I'm a sucker for the edge pools that overlook water views like this. Just unbelievable. Inside, you're going to find what you expect out of a house built in 2017. It features vaulted ceilings, expansive windows to take advantage of the view, and a first floor master suite. And I do mean suite as it is a big room with stunning water views, a sitting room, a luxurious bathroom, and a bonus room or office. Now, the family room has a gorgeous fireplace with a beam ceiling. Then there's the kitchen, which is the heart of every home nowadays. It has high-end white inlay cabinets with high-end stainless steel appliances and a very large island. There's a 160 bottle wine refrigerator for when you really get thirsty. But I think my favorite feature in, in this house is the hidden TV that's beneath the padded bench in the office. There's also another 2.11 acre lot with a secondary dock and sandy beach that really enhances this main property. Now the top 10 list. It felt like this was a Barnstable versus Boston battle with a couple honorable mentions thrown in the mix. I should mention that this is the top 10 list for houses that hit our MLS, which is MLS PIN. There may have been some other private sales that were not listed here or were maybe listed on smaller MLSs. As an example, the one used for the islands. A great example of a house is maybe 218 Cliff Road that sold in Nantucket for $15 million or 23 and 25 Pilgrim Road that was also in Nantucket that sold for $14.5 million. But what fun is it looking at a house that's sold if you can't peek under that hood, right? It doesn't matter if you're looking for a house like these or a smaller one, or even a lot, lot smaller one. And whether you're looking to buy or sell a home in the next nine or 90 days, then I'm your guy. I'd love to chat with you. All of my contact information, it's in the description below, or you can reach me at youtuberealestate.com, answer a couple questions, and I'll reach out to you. Again, my name is Jeff Chubb, and I look forward to hearing from you. Until next time.